Thank you for tuning in to Green Healthcare International. Today we're going to talk about dental implants with diabetes, what you should do, and what's worked for us, and what's worked for our patients, uh, which, which is most important for us as patient advocates. Things that you should think about when you're doing dental treatments when being having diabetes is the following. It is that you should think about is that your bone structure. Bone structure, particularly in diabetes, and a lot of times, not always, but a lot of times, it's very deteriorated. So what do you have to do prior to getting implants with diabetes? Things that work for us is this, is that when you come to, the, uh, whether here or abroad, here in Costa Rica or in Mexico, you want to do it the following way. You want to introduce the bone graft prior to putting in the implant. Why? What's helped for us is that it builds up bone structure where it fails with other people. But now, what happens is that when you come back four months later to do, put the implant in, yes, you have to open up again, but you have a greater chance for that implant not to fail. This is something that, that we've done and it's worked for our patients. I Hopefully this information is, will work for you. And if you do choose to have dental implants or surgery or anything in Mexico or Costa Rica, please consider us and have a great day. Hope you're doing good. Thank you.